Hey everybody, how's it going? Jamie Wagner here again. I'm going to do a video here on how to upload all your photos at one time using Picasa 3, uh, which is Google's digital photo software, editing photo software, and whatnot. Um, basically, um, what you want to do is uh, open up your Picasa software, uh, let it scan all your photos, and once it's done, it um, takes a little while, at least for me it did, I have several. Uh, over here on the left, you're going to see, you know, everything populate. Once once Google uh, Picasa uh, 3 gets itself all situated and scans all your photos, you're going to go up here to the top right and you want to log into your account. Make sure you're logged into your account. And basically what you want to do then is come over to where it says File and come across until you get the tools. Uh, come down to Batch Upload and uh, if you click batch upload you're gonna see that I have three folders over here that I have not uploaded yet so um, and you're gonna see this menu down here pop up so real quick I'm gonna cancel back out of it though just to show you uh, what's going on with the folders here the ones here that have green arrows on them I already completed a batch upload on all these entire photos okay and to the very left of the folder there is a sync symbol which is basically over here on the right you can turn the sync you can disable sync like if I click disable it removes that little sync symbol so I'm going to leave sync on that way on my computer if I add f any more photos to this particular folder like this particular folder right here um, it's going to automatically sync the photos to my Google account which is awesome so all this stuff is, is pretty sweet once you uh, learn how to go through and turn all the settings on and get it all all situated. Uh, the process goes really smooth. So basically, uh, I'm going to go ahead and go back in batch upload mode. And this is like the same thing as uploading all, fo you know, all photos. Uh, basically, again, go to the top, come across the menu, go to tools, select tools, come down to batch upload. It's about halfway down. Click batch upload. And the program knows to exclude all the ones you previously uploaded, so they're all gone. Um, one thing you can try is if you go right up here to where it says folders, and you right-click over top of that little green arrow, you can select all. That'll select your whole entire list instead of going down on one by one and checking. So that may save you a little bit of time. So we're going to go ahead and select all. And again, I'm in batch upload mode, so down here at the bottom you're going to see this menu. You want to make sure you're selected here for upload. Uh, these two options, you can use those options later once your photos are already upline. You can remove them online altogether, and you know you can change options. Uh, it's it's a good, nice little menu. So right here's your upload options. Um, this is going to be the size I upload mine at. Uh, visibility only me. So you want to select the one that says only you, and that's basically only you that can view the, the files and the pictures. And sync, I'm going to go ahead and turn sync on. So that's going to sync each of those folders. So now you just click OK and a little dialog pops up um, basically reassuring you that the online album visibility will be only you. Sync is on. Basically you click yes. Up here in the top right you're not going to see anything happen or you may you want to click this little symbol spinning. That'll open up your upload manager so you can see your progress um, right here you can see 100 um, percent I've used this uh, several times now and it's it's stable it doesn't crash on me um, I did all these at once a couple thousand photos you know it took a little while but I basically <laughs> selected them all and sat back and watched this uh, upload manager go right on through the list and uh, I was able to go work on something else while it was working in the background so it, it really works well um, and, and this allows me to have a copy of my photos on the internet up in my Google account um, and it also allows me to have a copy on my computer so basically I'm gonna wait till this is done 
and then I'll go ahead and finish up. Another nice thing you can do with this, and I don't think I can select the command right now while I'm waiting for this upload manager, but as soon as it's done uploading here, I'll show you how you can go in and you can actually rename all your photos at once. And uh, I'll show you real quick where the where the menu is, where you select that under the menu options. There you go, pretty much done. Now my now you'll see that those photo you know they those uh, those folders have uh, green arrows on them now and they're in sync. So if I w if I go back up here to the menu, go to tools and go to batch upload, everything's gone. I mean, it, you know, it knows there's nothing more to batch upload. There's no more photos. So we'll cancel out of that. Um, the other thing I was talking about is under picture. So basically, you can go to batch edit and rename. You know, you can select a series of photos and, you know, whatever you have highlighted over here. Say I have this highlighted and I want to go to picture, batch edit, rename. Whatever I change that name to, it's going to change all the names here, and it you know it puts a series of numbers after. So that's really nice too. Um, and that's pretty much it. That's how you upload all your photos using Picasa 3. So thanks a lot for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video. See ya.